when anything happened, when someone bullied us or when um, a fight escalated, then you know, you'd just go in as well. And the thing is when you're bullied or when an argument starts, it starts to heat up very, very quickly. And then you automatically, just because the way that you're, you, know, you think about it, you automatically attack back. As soon as I got introduced to the program, it actually gave me a chance to stop and think about it. And instead of just lashing out straight away, I'd be able to walk away, think about it, and then deal with it later, rather than dealing with it and getting in trouble, uh, which I found that happened a lot. Until you can actually raise the consciousness of students and let them see what is happening in a conflict, how they're behaving and how other people are behaving, then they have the ability to change and make positive choices. I was 14 at the time when I got introduced. Um, the coordinator at Merrill School Grammar School was the one that introduced me. At the time, I didn't even know what mediation was. Um, at the start, I was very reluctant. I, was, I kept to myself, I held back. Just because I didn't understand the program as such. And um, in the beginning, I didn't want to be there. Um, but as soon as the training ended, I was actually more involved than I thought I'd ever be. Kia ora, I'm Johnny, and this is Daniel, and we'll be your mediators today. So mediation is just students helping other students to resolve their own problems. Also, we're in a neutral position, so we don't take sides or judge. The process worked um, quite perfectly, actually, because when you set the ground rules in the beginning, uh, it actually gives them an understanding that this is what we have to <coughs> stick to. Uh, what we say at Maori School is that if you don't uh, work to solve the problem, then we'll refer it on to a guidance counsellor or the deputy principal that's in charge of the mediation service. And nine times out of the ten, they don't want to go up to the office and get in trouble. At, at all levels, we do say that mediation deals with, um, well, at primary in particular, we say small stuff conflict, but it deals with not the huge big issues that um, are not, not appropriate for students. So at primary level we say that mediators deal with little things, they deal with relationship problems, they deal with name calling, sharing, ownership, um, all those little small stuff conflict type issues. What is your problem? Um, I don't want Kabir to play with me because I was, I was playing with my own friends. What was your problem? I wanted to play with just Karen. How did you feel about that? Cross, angry. How did you feel about that? Angry. <coughs> Do you have any solutions to help? Yes, Kara could say sorry and they could start a new game. What you're providing here is a language, a common language, that everyone knows um, they can use in mediation. They've got the words, the, the way to express their um, responses to conflict. With the mediation that I've done at school, it um, encouraged me to do it outside of school and take it to a profession a paid profession and that's why I decided to go to uh, Teachers College and also do a minor in conflict resolution. Um, I also want to keep that Māori aspect of my life uh, within the conflict resolution side. That's why I've chosen to do uh, Māori teaching. Um, yeah, and in the near future I do want to look at being an international mediator, um, going overseas and getting a Masters in International Mediation.